How's it going guys and welcome back to another video on the channel. Today I am going to be teaching you guys how to get one of the rarest items in Remnant 2, the Night Weaver's Grudge. Well, what does the Night Weaver's Grudge do? You gain a 20% critical hit chance and haste when within 15 meters of an entity suffering from status effect. So, the Night Weaver's Grudge, what do you have to do for it? Well, you need to place an item into the Night Weaver's Web, which is located at the end of the Night Weaver's storyline in Lasson. This is one that starts in the Morrow's Parish area. This Night Weaver's Web allows for quest items to be traded in for some hidden rewards, such as Drear's Anklet, which is shown here in the clip, and some stone carved statues. Most of these items will give you relic reward upgrades, or relic dust. However, there are a select few in the game that will give you secret rewards. So, what makes the Night Weaver's Grudge so hard to get? Well, the quest item needed for this amulet is in a specific side dungeon within Yesha. This side dungeon is called the Lament, and the item you need to be acquiring is Colette's Razor. Because quest items do not transfer between the adventure modes, this means that the only way to obtain the secret amulet is to find both the Lament side dungeon and the Nightweaver storyline in the same story world. What this means is that you must first roll a Yasha world to start off the story. Then you need to run through the whole of Yasha exploring every side dungeon to try to find the Lament side dungeon. Once you eventually find this side dungeon, you can then get up to the point where you obtain Colette's Razor. Do not use this key. You want to keep hold of this key in your inventory and exit the side dungeon. Next step is you will have to finish and complete the entirety of this Yasha world, progress on to the labyrinth, complete the labyrinth section of the story and obtain the biome key which allows you to access your next story chapter. Once you travel through the portal to La Somme, if you spawn into the palace courtyard, well guess what, you'll have to reset the entire process up to this point. If that happens, you must then reset the entire story process of what you've done so far up to this point. Once you manage to obtain both Colette's Razor and then you're lucky enough to roll the Nightweaver's story, you'll know the Nightweaver's story is the right one when you enter the area and you'll turn up in the Morris Parish area. You can then progress your way all the way through this story to get to the Nightweaver boss in La Somme. Just before fighting her, once you travel through to the Dream World, you can then turn Colette's Razor into the Nightweaver's web to obtain the Night Weaver's Grudge Amulet, and you, my friend, will have finally obtained one of the rarest items in the game. So, just for reference, this took me and a buddy of mine, both running worlds individually, just over six hours to get this combination of events to happen. So guys, if you want this incredibly mediocre amulet, because you're some sort of crazy collectionist like myself, be prepared for a huge grind with a tiny reward. Well, anyway, thanks for watching guys, and I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.